ear to shoulder and wow let that go mm. well welcome ashley yes nice hi i'm dr mary beth thank you for thank taking me today yes thanks for coming in um so this is the first time you've been here right we ha we haven't met before today mm -hmm. so we're just kind of starting off here um, and you have not been adjusted before. No. But you were recently in a car accident. Yes. Which you're being treated at another medical yes. place. So um, let's just talk about what's going on. Um, I am um, experiencing a little pain right here on my left side. Yes. Um, my range of motion is limited. Um, in your arm or in your neck? Um, or Throughout the neck, mm -hmm. back, and the top shoulder. Mm -hmm. So um, those are my areas of concern. Okay. Any headaches, numbness, or tingling? No, more so a dull, sharp aching. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then, and you didn't have any of that before the accident, right? No. Any pain with that? No pain. How about if we go that way? No pain. Okay. So then look that way. Any pain as you look that way? Just really can't extend it to the full. Yep. Mm hmm And then let's go the other way. That's the way it seems a little easier. Yes. So it's harder to look to the right, but yes. you feel it on the left. Correct. Mm -hmm. okay. And then you come behind you. So if I press down on your head, does that cause you any pain? I, I, I feel it. You do? Mm -hmm. Okay. And it feels like sore. Yes. Right? The, it kind of makes that dull, dull achy. Yes. Yes. Okay. And if I lift up, does that change it at all? Make it a little relief or about the same? A, a little relief. I feel, yeah. I feel it. Okay. And then how about if I do a little stretch here? You feel that? Yes. Yeah. Let's try this side. Anything on this side? Anything on that side? Nothing on this side. I, yeah. I felt it on this, the left side. Yeah. Now, what, what kind of car accident were you at? How are you hit? Um, I was T-boned on my driver's side. Um, door was jammed shut, um, so, so I had to crawl out through the passenger. Okay. And that was your first accident, first too. First accident. Always yes. scary, isn't yeah, it? Definitely. I, get, I, I have been in, in an accident, and it's always scary. And you don't always feel the pain right away. Right away, Sometimes yes. it takes a little bit for it to come, but oof, when it comes. And we've had x-rays, so everything is clear. Yes. Probably just some changes in the posture, which means usually because of the, the, the muscle changes, the neck, instead of having a nice curve in it, is straight, right? Right. Mm -hmm. So any issues with moving the arm? Yes. Right. Yes. Okay, so you, you got your shoulders involved yeah. too. Yes. Mm -hmm. Let's check this side. Okay, so you have a little tight shoulders, both sides. Maybe that's just you okay. and the accident made that worse. As I come here, is there pain through here? Not right there, more okay. so on the left. And while you're sitting, how about in the back? That right there, yes. How about there? Yes, ma'am. A little bit on both sides, but the right more? Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. how about in the middle? You feel that in the middle? Not much pain there. Okay. As I come up, yeah, it's a little bit. That's, yeah, I can feel already before you even stand up. We don't have a lot of motion here on that right side. Okay. So, um, and then I just want to make sure we don't have any other issues. It's been a little bit since the accident, so we're just going to check. So I want you to kind of look up to that corner of the room. So okay. turn your head, look up that way, and then tip your, yeah. And then good, just look at the pen. Any nausea, dizziness? No. Okay, good. And then we check this way. So we're just checking for vertebral sufficiency. Any issues with that nausea? No. Good. Perfect. I know. It's not comfortable. <laughs> I think for a little bit. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. So let's stand up. Yes. Why don't you actually face this way? I'll switch spots with you. Perfect. Okay. And you, wait, did I hear you're an aspiring model, is that correct? I am. What kind of model do you want to be? I do lifestyle shoots. Okay. Yes. And how often do you do that? I shoot maybe three to four times a month. Okay. Um, just to get a full content. Yeah. Um, to post for the month. Mm. Very cool. And you're also an esthetician. I am. Very cool. I do, uh, I do facials, okay. waxing, lashes. Mm -hmm. Yes. 
Let's see how we're moving here. Now, this is interesting. So is this a piercing? It is. How long has that been there? Going on five years. You know, this one is gone? It, it's missing its buddy. <laughs> <laughs> it's missing its buddy. You know, sometimes we lose them from our ears and we don't know. But, um, okay, well, that's interesting. I've never yes. seen one on an SI joint, right? So we're going to check that. I want okay. you to raise your right knee to your chest. Right knee. Okay. Yeah, a little stiff. But you did it. Now go drop that foot. Okay. And then ooh, a little clunk. Left okay. knee. Good. And down. Oh, you feel that? Yeah. Yeah. So you have a little bit. So your right hip is a little lower than your left. Okay. You know, there's a little bit of clicking, clacking, crunching in both sides, which tells me there's probably other parts of you that are not moving very well. Plus you have a little rotation in the pelvis. Okay. So so it is a little bit like that, right? So some of that is probably in any kind of impact, especially if you get hit from the side right. and you have a seatbelt on. Right. The seatbelts save us and they're important, but some parts of you can move and some parts of you can get, yeah, and they get, you get violently stopped. Or the air, did the airbags go off? It did not differently. Okay, okay, that's good, because yeah. those create their own issues. safety and issues. But um, it's just one of those things that really, um, does a number on the human body. And it used to be probably when we had those big heavy metal cars, they absorbed much more of the impact. But right now, the way they are made, our bodies absorb much more of the impact. So make sure you get the care that you need. And we're gonna take good care of you today. I'm probably gonna be a little gentle because you're you're stiff and you're sore. Okay. And so I, I don't wanna overdo anything because no you can overdo this. Okay. Okay, so why don't you just slide down on your stomach? Okay, face here? Yes. Okay. Right in the middle there, your feet down here. Perfect. And we're just gonna spend a little time relaxing. Okay. Because, you know, I, I repeat this all the time, but when someone's new, you know, you're new to me, I'm new to you. Yes. <laughs> and now I'm touching you. Okay. Ah! <laughs> And I'm here to help, but I think it's a normal human response to think that it just, it just takes a minute. So I want you to just do some nice deep breaths. Good job. So how stressful is it your work? Is it stressful? Is it fun? I would say my job is more so on the relaxing tip. Mm. Um, it's just more so the posture that I have to maintain after the accident is a little uncomfortable. For modeling or esthetician or more? Esthetician, mm. yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you kind of lean over people. Yes. Yeah. Add a few Probably do for one, too. Okay, let's give you a little bit. We're gonna do a little stretch on the low back so okay. the table will move. Okay. If anything hurts or you're not comfortable, you tell me, okay? Certainly. Okay, now I hear a little accent in your voice. Where is your accent from? I'm from Haiti. Haiti. Yes. How long have you been here? Or did you? I'm of Haitian descent. Ah. Yes, mm -hmm. I was born here. So, do you speak well, Haitian? They speak yes. that, like it's a, a, a Creole. French. A Creole. Yes. Okay. So, um, it's like Spanish and French put together. Ah. So a mixture. So if someone speaks French to you, you can understand that. Some words, yes. Um, it is a blend, so you can pick up on some of the words, but um, it may relay differently. Mm-hmm. You know, it's funny. Um, people say it, but. We hear ourselves differently than how other people hear us. Oh, is that right? So I don't hear my, I don't hear the accent. Oh, you don't. <laughs> but everybody it's else faint. does. Yes. It's very faint. Well, people say I have an accent too. Where are you from? The Wisconsin. Okay. <laughs> they have the best. No more exotic. No more fun. But um, I think it used to be stronger. It's gotten less so. Certain words like, you know, when you get a bag at the grocery store. Right. <laughs> Or the roof is on the top of the house, not the roof. Yes. It's weird. Car. I hear they have the best cheese. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, I 
think that's something I would never take out of my diet. Yes. And you know what's funny is I don't like goat cheese. Oh, no. Only cows. Yes. <laughs> Good. So you'll feel me lift your legs like that. Okay. The leg link checks just give me information about what's happening in the rest of your spine. Yeah, I can really feel a lot of tension up in here on this left side. So let's see what I can do to help. So I have an instrument, it's called an activator, and I use it to adjust where I want to be specific or gentle. Okay. So both in your case. Okay. So you'll feel that. Okay. And a little pop, click. It's not much, right? Okay. It's very, is that easy? Pretty comfortable? Yes. Okay. And that, excuse me, is how I adjust the sacrum. <laughs> Liam. Thank you. I usually warn people, but. So what's the most interesting photo shoot you've ever done? Mm. I've done several. They are all pretty fun, but recently I just went out to the Venetian pool out in Coral Gables. Mm -hmm. It was a nice location. Um, I would definitely recommend. Nice place to go with your family. What is Relax. it? Relax. Um, it's like a, 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 a nice pool, lagoon, if you will. Oh, okay. Yes. Fun. Okay. Which side did your low back hurt on? More so on the right. Mm, yeah. That's what I'm going to adjust today. So you do get massage at the office, right? Yes, they have me doing um, once or twice a week, depending on when the therapist is there. Let's just see how stiff we are. I'm just going to lift that up a little bit. Tuck your tag. There we go. I'm just checking the tissue over your vertebra. I feel a little tight? Yes. Yeah, it's, it's actually really tight. Because usually I can, especially on someone so thin, I can do that. So I'm going to do a nice stretch here. Good. Just a little stretch. So, yeah, just let your hip fall into my hand. That's a good girl. I know you're trying to help me. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Good. Just a nice stretch. There we go, good. Where did you feel it? In your low back or in here? Right where you were. Yeah, 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 because I felt you immediately tense up. So let me see if I can loosen this up at all. So I'm gonna put my hands in and I'm gonna have you take a deep breath in. Okay. Breathe in and let it out. Blow it all the way out. Good, let your chest drop. And a little push, let the chest drop. There we go. Wow, very stiff, which is normal. I think I, I see that after an accident a lot. So I'm gonna do some light, soft tissue work here. We're just gonna try to get some blood flow to tissues. What else do you do? Would you do anything for fun? I like to roller skate um, on my free time. Nice one of exercise. Yeah. Yeah. Where do you do that? Um, at the skating rink. Or oh, you do? A, yeah, nice smooth surface on the outside. I think, do people roller skate on Bayshore? I, I'm new to the Tampa area. Oh. Yeah. So where is that, if you don't know? Um, 
I think it's down kind of where your spa is okay. in South Tampa. Okay. Um, it's a long, like, it goes along on the, one of the main roads that goes through downtown Tampa or around there. Mm -hmm. I'm also not, you know, From real, yeah, not an expert. I just have ridden bikes down there. It seems like and, it'll be a nice area for that. And when I used to run, we used to run there. How's that feeling? Is that okay? It feels very nice. Okay, it's not too much? No. I'm going kind of gentle on you because I don't want to overdo it. So your tissues are still real tense and sore. So, And if I saw you more regular, then I could okay. kind of get a sense for how much I can do. So most of the time when someone's new, I say, well, you're, well, let's do three visits, okay. and I get to know you, you get to know me, and I see how your body responds, and then I can say, hey, you're going to need this much visits. On your first visit, yeah. it's so hard to know. Right. Yeah, and this isn't even your tight side. Is that feeling okay? Yes. Good. Perfect. Let me do a little bit on this side, your tighter side, and see if we can I have roller skated, and I, of course, when I was young, I used to go to the rink, you know. Yes. That was a big thing to do yes. <laughs> back in the day. What Now I for sure need helmet and knee pads. And what you would say, accident prone. <laughs> Usually my brain is in a different part than where my body is, so. I'm just kind of thinking, or, or I move too fast. Yes, it's all about balance. Yeah, but when you have wheels on, that's a different story. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I tend to freak out. And <laughs> it is. So I probably would say I wouldn't let myself go on roller skates, but skateboards for sure, never. Never? Mm -mm. No, I would. That would be an immediate trip to the nearest <laughs> You're going to be on this <laughs> Right? Okay, now we get into it. You feel that? Yes. It's right where your levator skip comes off your skin. So, just tell me if it's too much, okay? No problem. Is it okay right now? Yes. Good. So, do they have chiropractors in Haiti? I would think so. <laughs> I've what do you call them? To go back home. Oh, I'm always curious because in different countries yes. they'll call them different. So um, anything within like um, re that requires going to like a medical office, we would say "kai doctor," which is meaning the house of the doctor. Ah. Yes. Kai doctor. Yes. Okay. Stretch here. Stretch your neck. Yeah, you okay with that? I feel a little push. Good. Again, going very gentle on you. Okay, good. So try to relax that ear. Yes, good. Perfect. You feel that? I heard that. <laughs> Was that okay? Yes. Perfect. That was a good one. So. All right. So we'll work on your lower back now. So I'm gonna have you lie on your left side. So face me, bring all your arms. Perfect. And you can rest your head down. And bring your bottom close to me, close to the edge. There we go, good. This bottom leg is gonna be straight. Have they done this on you? No. Okay, so this is the way I isolate that left SI joint. 
I'm gonna get this other arm. There, that better? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna put that there. And then that there, perfect. Feel that? That feel a little tight there? Yes. Yes. So you're gonna feel, we're gonna do a little stretch, a little squeeze. See if we can not help move this a little bit. So take a nice deep breath. Let that go. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was more so this uh, but I'm okay. That was a good one. That, that was, was a, a very one. deep one. Yes. And I didn't push real hard, yes. so I didn't have it was to. Very yes, yes, good. Okay, let's not that it hurt. Roll it to the so other cool. side. I know, but it just surprised me a little bit. <laughs> You're so little. Okay, come to the edge again. Very good. We're gonna put this here. Straighten out. Good. Perfect. Arm there. Yes, just like that. You're a pro. Are you sure you haven't done this? Okay. <laughs> okay, big breath. Let it out. Stretch. Yes, yes, yes. Wow, that was easy. I didn't really have to push. Sure? Okay, you're going to go on your back. Okay. You're going to scoot down just a touch. Perfect. So when I did that one on the upper back, that is could be upper thoracic first rib but that'll help with some of that tension you were feeling in there okay may even help you get a little more range of motion in that shoulder i'll check it in a minute so with the neck i know already that you're limited in your range of motion right and you were having trouble looking to the right. left or right. no it's to the right so so that gives me information on what segments of the spine in your neck I probably need to look at so this feels very very stiff <laughs> you feel that too sorry is that painful it's not painful no apologize that's what you're here for so what I'm going to do is I'm going to adjust that just like I did your low back okay. or your middle back and just go from there so I'm going to just bring that right ear over to the shoulder drop the right shoulder down let it <clears throat> easy right mm -hmm. Good, and then drop the left shoulder, good. Shoot, ear to shoulder, and... Wow. That's good. <laughs> That's really good. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Wow. I'm excited to see how you can move after that. So, let's check your feet. Feet are so important. They didn't get hurt in the accident necessarily, but they work hard, right? So we're going to let this stretch, open up that hip, yep, a little tug, just like that, good. And where's my clean neck? Let me grab it. So. Okay, girl, not a lot of motion in there. Okay. <laughs> you, you, uh, do you walk barefoot at all? I do, I, need, I think I need to. Maybe yeah, I think you need to. I think you do, I think so. So if I, can't, if I can't get much motion out of these, they're usually pretty easy to crack, then I think let's just work on feet. Yeah, because I think you have a little bit more towards the flat foot. So the stronger your feet are, the better. Okay. That's gonna be good. So now sit up and face that way towards the mirror. Perfect. Hook you up. All right, now I just want you to kind of move that neck gently. How's that feel? Much better. Yeah. Yeah, so to turn, look, look this way, because that's, yeah. That, I can tell that's easier. Yes. Less pain? Definitely. Good. Okay, so before we check the shoulder, let's just see. Well, what do you think about that, girl? It's like I'm new again. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even adjust your shoulder yet. All I did oh, was your neck goodness. and your upper back. I That's like pretty that. cool, that huh? Felt very nice. Because you couldn't get it up past halfway. Okay, so this side still feels a little stiff. So I'm going to adjust both shoulders. So you're okay. going to put your hand on your hip, good. Okay. And you're going to just kind of feel. I'm going to brace you with my leg. Okay. Feet on the ground, and then you're going to push your elbow back into my. Push your elbow back. Okay. Yes, like that. Good. 
One more time, go ahead. Okay, so let's check this side. Looks like your feet, the feet didn't crack, so. But we're still moving it. Okay. Can't push the elbow back into my hand. Good, okay. and then one more time, push. Okay. Any pain when I do that? No. Good, okay. So I'm, j I'm actually amazed. Before I even did your shoulders. Okay, so they're still a little bit stuck there. This isn't your hurt side, but I feel like I want to look at that. Sorry, I'm trying to get that out of your way. <laughs> did you ever have an injury on this shoulder? Not that I recall. Maybe I was thinking like it's like my posture at work, like I was mentioning. Mm -hmm. I have to do better. Maybe I mean posture, our daily stuff yeah. does affect. That's a little better. So you, there was definitely some issue with how the humerus was sitting in the okay. socket. Okay. So it could be something that's been there a long time, or maybe you know who knows. Okay. But, you know, in your sleep, do you sleep on your side at all? I do. You sleep on your I'm right a side. Side sleeper. Yeah, because that'll that'll do it. Um, okay. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do my friend. She's a chiropractor. She taught me this move. It's called okay. the finisher move. Okay. Or backpack. So you're gonna just put gently put your hands here. And I'm gonna kind of put you on like a backpack. Mm -hmm. So just put your, yeah, good. And then I'm gonna come around here. Hi. Hi. How you doing, Ashley? <laughs> we just met. Good. This is a pretty good little position, right? Okay. So you're gonna just kind of lean back into me, good. Okay. And you're gonna take a nice deep breath in and let it out, good. <coughs> what do you think about that? Wow. <laughs> Amazing. What do you think about that? <laughs> that was really good, right? Yes. yes, we got a little bit more in there. Oopsie, yes. you got your hair in my mic. Okay. Got it? Yes. Oh, sorry. Okay. I think that was a very successful yes. yet gentle adjustment. Like I went like gentle on purpose because I want to make sure that yes. you're not too sore. So let's stand up. Okay. And I just kind of want you to shake that out, see how that feels. Yeah? How's that feel? That, good. Feel, that, that feels better. A more range of motion, definitely. Yeah, yeah. More relaxed, more loose. Yeah. Um, I did not receive that type of treatment. And I, I'm happy I came. Thank you. Good, good. I'm glad that you did. Um, and so we'll talk more about when you can come back. Okay. But, um, you know, just keep taking care of yourself. Take it easy. And we'll get there. Definitely. Just not, you need to go a little slow. Okay. Since that. But anyways, we're so glad you had. We're Thank here. You Thank you. Thank you. And me. so thank you, Ashley. And watch and subscribe or like and subscribe. Thank you, Dr. Mary Beth. <laughs> Bye. I thought you were gonna start whining. Oh my goodness. <laughs>